there essentially are three ways to mitigate glycidyl ester or G. First, minimize G formation in the deodorizer by limiting the temperature and residence time. Second, refining it with, it with activated bleaching earths followed by mild deodorization. And third, G is stripping. There is also a force mitigation methods, the alpha level the zero G. This imaging technology is now underway to be demonstrated in at industrial scale, and Alpha Laval expects to release the technology by year end. Details will be forthcoming. Refining stage. It is most common practice which is used today in the industry, since it can bring the amount of PPM to the level 0 0.2, 0 0.3 PPM. Although it has high operating costs and capital investment if you're planning to build up the new plant having the refinery, since mild redodorization is required after post bleaching. While direct stripping, when you apply the G stripper, requires add-on into your refinery and takes place at the existing deodorization process or modified existing deodorization process and can bring level of G below to 0 0.5 ppm. Of course, it is a subject of G which content in the fit means how much G are generated during the deodorization and holding. Alpha Laval has long tradition of supplying flexible and reliable deodorization technology. Here you see a timeline of the innovations the company has launched since the 1960s, building upon upwards trajectory with, low, with novel ways to addressing today's challenges, such as G mitigation. Alpha Laval Palm Flex refining is the most recent innovation in deodorization technology. Each generation of the technology includes experience gained from the previous model with focus on efficiency, operating cost, and investment. Trade deodorizer, the first which used for the, or it is a base for deodorization and typically has been used for chemical refined oils at the beginning. Later on, physical refinery of palm oil, of course, shifted to the run this process in trade deodorizer, but since of high cost and high uh, steam consumption lead to the introducing on the market pack column solution. Physical refinery by using pack column has been done by Alpha Laval as a pioneer in this industry. And since that time, we are staying on thin film technology till today. Soft column deodorizer, which became as a base or which has been based on the using pack column with introduction modulized units for the final heating and economizing under vacuum. Also, Fast drain valves, FDV, has been introduced as a part of soft column TM. It brings flexibility to retention time with aim to reduce or to control uh, TFM formation at uh, seed oil, in seed oils. Dual strip has been launched 2009, and this is also thin film based technology, and it is still thin film technology in the focus. Splitting stripping task in two columns, pre and post stripping, allows to keep ability to effective stripping free fatty acid at high temperature with following reduction of temperature by quench economizing before keeping oil in holding section. This gives possibility to control trans fatty acid formation at deodorization step, balancing with required color of deodorized oil. And since 2018, we launch Palm Flex Refining, where we put also focus on low GE. Dual strip still is base, which is modified or updated to this technology, Why GE stripper, specially designed stripping column, which can hold the task of removing the GE. 